This hearing will now come to order. Hear ye, hear ye. This hearing is now in session. Today's first order of business is Adam, the common man, versus the United States President and the Government of the United States of America. I yield to Adam, the common man. Adam, the common man, you have the floor. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Here is my response to the President of America and to the people of the United States of America. This is the year of our Lord, 2019 A.D. Yet, in so many ways, it seems like we are living in the Dark Ages. My colleagues may think it's okay that the Russians offer dirt on a Democratic candidate for president as part of what was described as the Russian government's effort to help the Trump campaign. You might think that's okay. My colleagues might think it's okay that when that was offered to the son of the president, who had a pivotal role in the campaign, that the president's son did not call the FBI. He did not adamantly refuse that foreign help. No, instead that son said that he would love the help of the Russians. You might think it's okay that he took that meeting. It's not okay. Are you kidding? No way. It's not okay. This doesn't sit well with me. Oh, oh. We have to do something. Oh, liars. You might think it's okay that Paul Manafort, the campaign chair, someone with great experience in running campaigns, also took that meeting. You might think it's okay that the president's son-in-law also took that meeting. You might think it's okay that they concealed it from the public. You might think it's okay that their only disappointment after that meeting, that the dirt they received on Hillary Clinton wasn't better. You might think that's okay. It's not okay. Are you kidding? It's not okay. No way. Doesn't sit well with me. Mob tactics. That's what it is. Corruption. Corruption. Hurrah. You might think it's okay that when it was discovered a year later that they'd lied about that meeting and said it was about adoptions. You might think it's okay that the president is reported to have helped dictate that lie. You might think that's okay. I don't. You might think it's okay that the campaign chairman of a presidential campaign would offer information about that campaign to a Russian oligarch in exchange for money or a debt of forgiveness. You might think that's okay. I don't. I call for Adam the Common Man's resignation. He is no longer fit for the job of congressman. You might think it's okay that that campaign chairman offered polling data, campaign polling data, to someone linked to Russian intelligence. I don't think that's okay. You might think it's okay that the president himself called on Russia to hack his opponent's emails if they were listening.
You might think it's okay that later that day, in fact, the Russians attempted to hack a server affiliated with that campaign. I don't think that's okay. You might think that it's okay that the president's son-in-law shot to establish a secret back channel of communication with the Russians through a Russian diplomatic facility. I don't think that's okay. You might think it's okay that an associate of the president made direct contact with the CRU through Julian Assange and WikiLeaks and considered that is considered a hostile intelligence agency. You might think it's okay a senior campaign official was instructed to reach that associate and find out what that hostile intelligence agency had to say in terms of dirt on his opponent. <coughs> no collusion. There was no collusion. No obstruction of justice. It's over, Adam, the common man. <laughs> Son, you can take your liberal snowflake ideas to your posh condo in Vail. You might think it's okay that the National Security Advisor designate secretly conferred with a Russian ambassador about undermining U.S. sanctions. And you might think it's okay he lied about it to the FBI. You might say that's all okay. You might say that's just what you need to do to win. But I don't think it's okay. I think it's immoral. I think it's unethical. I think it's unpatriotic. And yes, I think it's corrupt and evidence of collusion. <laughs> it's not okay. It's not. Are you kidding? It's not okay. No way. Doesn't sit well with me. Oh, we have to do something. Liars. Liars. Now, I have always said that the question whether this amounts to the proof of conspiracy was another matter. Whether the special counsel could prove beyond a reasonable doubt, the proof of that crime would be up to the special counsel, and I would accept his decision, and I do. He's a good and honorable man, and he's a good prosecutor, but I do not think that conduct, criminal or not, is okay. And the day we think that that's okay is the day we will look back and say that this is the day America lost its way. And I will tell you one more thing that is appropriate of the hearing today. I don't think it's okay that during a presidential campaign, Mr. Trump sought the Kremlin's help to consummate a real estate deal in Moscow that would make him a fortune, according to the special counsel, hundreds of millions of dollars. I don't think it's okay that he concealed it from the public. I don't think it's okay that he advocated a new unfavorable policy towards the Russians, even as he was seeking the Russians' help, the Kremlin's help, to make money. Oh. I don't think it's okay that his attorney lied to our committee. There's a different word for that than collusion. It's called compromise, and that is the subject of our hearing today. Adam the common man must resign. It's not a okay. corruption. corruption. It's it not doesn't okay. sit well no with me. Mob tactics. Well with That's me. what it is. That's we have to do is. something. Corruption. Liars. Corruption. Liars. 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 Li